Today is September 4th, 2011, Sunday. Tao Te Ching 69, translated by Hapung Kim, 2005. The strategist saying, I dare not play the host, but play the guest. I dare not advance an inch, but retreat a foot. This is called marching no marching, stretching no arms, arming with no weapons, charging at no enemy. No disaster is greater than making light of the enemy. When I make light of the enemy, I may lose my treasure. Therefore, when two sides confront each other with arms, the one who grieves wins. Tao Te Ching 69, translated by Henry Wei, 1982. Military strategists have said, I dare not be the host, but prefer to be the guest. I dare not advance one inch, but prefer to retreat a foot. This is called marching as if without motion, brandishing arms as if having none, attacking as if without enmity, seizing as if without weapons. No disaster is greater than belittling the enemy. Belittling the enemy almost ruins my treasures. Therefore, when two armies encounter each other, the side that laments war will win. Tao Te Ching 69, translated by Keith H. Seddon, 2006. The strategists have a saying, I dare not take the offensive, but would rather take the defensive. I dare not advance an inch, but would rather retreat a foot. This is called marching without moving, rolling up one's sleeve without showing one's arm, defeating an enemy without confrontation, being armed without weapons. No misfortune is greater than underestimating an enemy. Underestimating an enemy almost makes me lose my treasures. Therefore, when two sides take arms against each other, it is the side with the most reluctance which wins.